having me. Well, hello to both of you. Thank you so much for your time today. Um, Thank you, Bunny. You're so welcome. I have to tell you both that the first thing I did when I walked before I started to watch a series, I called all my relatives in Israel, who I knew had watched this immediately. And they all gave their, like, not only thumbs up, but they just love the series. So, Todaraba, <laughs> first of all, for this. And, <laughs> and, and, yeah, Steve, I want to start with you. Um, what a, what an amazing, rich role Tamar is. My goodness, there's so many layers. I wanted to know, first off, what your, your initial reaction was to it and why you wanted to play her so badly. Um, as you said, it's an amazing role for me. I just graduated acting school not so far, not so long ago. And to get this role is a huge gift. She has so many colors, she carries so many layers and depth, and she's so strong emotionally and physically. And she's going through so many, and her journey is fascinating. So uh, for me as an actress, you know, this is the type of, of role that I dreamt of. Yeah, absolutely, for sure. And Sean, uh, thank you again for your time. I'm such a big fan. My gosh, I've been watching you on the big and small screen for so many years. Again, what a, what a, for us, like, what a great opportunity to play a guy like this. Because again, more lots of layers. But I understand you didn't just jump on board right away. Tell me about that. Well, you know, just generally, uh, you know, uh, I all these years it's always been like this with uh, with me you know i don't i don't just take the project just to take the project you know it it has to really talk to me yeah. it has to really feel something you know to, to me and uh and uh the the blessing of this uh the show is the script uh, yeah. you know when when they they send it to me when when i started reading it it was uh, it it's it's it was so well written and it you know, everything starts with the script. And and the, when the character of Faraz uh, really, you know, when I start reading it and, and if I feel it and I feel that I can, you know, do good in it, um, that's that's why, that's when I take the role. And it took a little while uh, for us to, you know, talk about it, but uh, it's just been a, it's just been an amazing uh, journey. Yeah, uh, oh. such a surprise, such a surprise. Yeah, really great. I love how, uh, like all the characters, you really don't know who's who's doing what, who's thinking what. And and me for you, uh, like I say, such a great opportunity, but there had to have been some preparation. It's not so easy to get into the mindset of a Mossad agent, for sure, you know, but just not like the physical, but also like, had you known any Farsi before this? No, no, I've never heard Farsi before. Wow. So I had to learn it and I, I it wasn't easy, but it was um, very, very interesting. And not only the language, I had to really learn, you know, the culture and really immerse myself in it. And it was fascinating. Yeah, uh, yeah, I can just imagine. And also your preparation physically too? Did you, you did what? Krav yeah, Maga? yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, great. Yeah, Krav lessons. Wow, that was, I was surprised. I was much better than I expected, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you have to kick butt, which is good. So that you did, you did a good job. Yeah, uh, I'm, sh I'm sure right. she has a lot of she has, she has a lot of bruises to show for it. So I wouldn't doubt that. I wouldn't doubt that. Um, Sean, what, what's really interesting too? What I love about this series, it's there's um, a lot of moral dilemmas going on. You know, it's it's between you know the fight about the love for your country and and being loyal but also the love and loyalty for your family. And, and also like with your character, Sean, he's, he's torn, his wife is sick and he doesn't know like, should I, I don't, should I go with her or should I, I stay for my country? What do you feel about that? And showing, showing this facet of this story. You know, that's why, that's why the script is so good. And, and uh, it, it allows you to really human, uh, you know, make people human. And also show, you know, different facets of 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 uh, characters, and uh, you know the complexity of characters. You know the, the the fact that he he loves his wife so much, but at the same time he loves the country, and he is his loyalty to to the country itself, and that is why uh, you know the characters, all of them have such such struggles, and and that's why it it makes it 
you know, an interesting show for people to watch and, uh, and enjoy, hopefully. Uh, yeah, absolutely. It's very, very intense. Like very from the first minute of the show, you know, you're uh, the plane, the whole thing. I'm, I, I get, you know, I, I, I get hyper watching these shows. Neve, do you like these <laughs> intense thriller types of shows? Because making them is one thing, but you like to watch them. Yeah, and I think that um, what I like most is that, is that it's not only high tense action uh, series. It has much more than this in it. So I think that everyone can relate and can enjoy it because it's not also, you know, not only uh, action. Oh, no, absolutely not. And I, I yeah, that's one thing I want to ask you about that because um, it was very eye opening to me. Obviously, I've never been to Iran. I've been to Israel many, many, many times. But, you know, obviously the countries are, are not friendly right now, but it was not like that in the past, you know? And what I love about this series is that we get to feel, especially me, who's somebody who's Jewish, gets to see the cultures. You know, everybody is the same. You know, we all love our food, our cultures, our 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 dance, our music. Uh, quickly, can you can you talk about that, Neve? Yeah, sure. I think that um, we put in a lot of effort to show uh, different Iran, a different point of view of this country and of this uh, Tehran, of this city, uh, to show you know the vibrant culture and way of dressing and food and culture and you know glance into the secret life of young people in Iran that wants to live uh, freely. And and these are things that haven't really been explored on screen before. And for me, it was so exciting and fascinating. And because what I know about Iran was just what I read and what yeah. I you know see in the media. And it was just, it made me fall in love in this country and city. Yeah, and Sean, quickly for you, because you were born there. Of course, you moved when you were very, very young. Yeah. But to see, yeah. you know, what is portrayed in this series must be fantastic <clears throat> for you. It, it, it's that, that this is the beauty of the script, you know, that uh, it's a very, very balanced show. And, and it, it shows that the end of the day, uh, as I always say, uh, it's people are just people, yeah. and it shows the humanity of people. And the, the you know we have everybody has the day to day struggles, and uh, and uh, we were hoping that this show will will bring people together, uh, you know, and uh, and show that uh, and we are just the same. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's fantastic. I, I love, I so always get so excited when new Israeli series come, you know, Shtisel and Fauda and this, and my goodness, you just, just keep, keep them coming. <laughs> I really do appreciate your time today and uh, so you. lovely to meet you both via Zoom. Thank you so much for your time. Pleasure. You too, pleasure. Bonnie. Thank you. Thank you.